friends this will be our ultimate battery homemade totally homemade the box the inner individual cells all that is homemade okay. this will positive and negative 12 volt and 10 amps battery homemade do it yourself project 12 volt and 10 amps for this now i have taken uh, i show i'm showing you i have taken see this is a bottle 250 ml bottle i have cut the top i have cut the top so after cutting the top what it becomes a container so like this i have taken six containers like this six containers are taken so each will be one cell each will be a cell so what i have done for each cell we need electrodes two to electrodes so this is a pvc tube now i cut like this then insert into this lead this is a lead strip so for each cell we need two to lead strips and here four like this here two is there another two will be here because to fill the lead paste you know lead oxide paste to fill that i have made grids here so we can fill the lead paste here so all those details you can already see you can see in my previous uh, lead acid battery videos so this is there will be four because uh, there will be four so in each term i mean electrode there will be four four i drawn here no like that then we have to fill the lead paste lead oxide paste see i cannot show you everything because already my videos i have taken some four five videos individual videos on on this battery which are lost due to my what do you call my cell no something damaged there when i transferred those details you know all that got vanished so what remaining with that i am showing this so actually i lost all my videos so some small videos had that i am going to club together and showing it so i written everything in paper how i perform all that so these are all just a practical demo i am showing you so my previous lead acid battery videos will tell you how i have made all this small that was small this is a bigger one actually this is 6.5 inches and this is all what you call uh, 0.75 inches 0.75 by each there will be four like that so each electrode no it consumes 120 grams of lead oxide all those details i have given in my first paper so like that here i am going to paste it this is only pvc tubes i am cutting it and then what is the ratio to lead powders i have take red lead all that i have given you for your you can do it yourself that is why this is purely homemade with our own containers with our own lead strip pvc all that i we have made it even the second i am showing you here this second page where after pasting no we keep in this container this is single cell like that i have made six cells for six cells how much you need 12 strips like this 12 strips when each strip you need four four pvc cuts so for each cell you need eight eight pvc cuts all that should be pasted with that lead oxide paste that should be pasted all that i written you have to paste that and then dry for 24 hours soak it in 10 percent sulfuric acid that is called soaking or leaching all this already you can see my lead acid previous video no that will give you complete idea on that how to make it only thing here we are made in a macro level bigger level so then comes forming forming you need 20 percent sulfuric acid for dc current we am using 5 volt and 2 amps i can use forming for 1 hour then discharge 10 minutes like that i have done three forming cycles after forming i will take out the 20 percent sulfuric acid and replace with 35 percent sulfuric acid fresh that again i will charge it using the same volt 2 amps 1 to 2 hours even 3 hours i have made it after 3 hours of charging i saw that it has attained volt of 2.1 constant and amps no individual cells were giving 4.6 amps i was able to give this is the second page you can note down In the third page i written i made a big box cardboard box so each cells no i just placed inside there so each cell carries two to electrodes positive negative like that after charging i put it with 35% sulfuric acid closely i will just then put the upper lid so we have to connect in series this will be positive the negative will be connected to another positive like that no the negative to positive so here while coming then it will be negative here one positive when you connect we see the volt as 12 volt and 10 amps 
for individual cell now i saw that it is volt is 2.1 and the current was 4.6 okay so all this i am showing you through diagram because this video you know i lost everything four videos i lost it but somehow i want to show to you that i have done and it will be useful to you so this is what i actually done this box no measures here 4 inches and this height is 6 inches because the inner cell also it is 5.5 inches so all that to be assembled here no so properly assembled this is the real picture after assembled this is real. our final we assembled all the six cells in series in the container in a container this i have cardboard container white container i made we assembled the six cells individual cells like that positive here the negative terminal to the another positive like that they are connected in series so this will be ultimate negative so this we have made now a full cell so we are expecting what is the volt already we have seen the volt is found to be like that we will again see in front of you i'll show you i connected the multimeter so this will be our negative terminal this will be a positive terminal you can see what is there so 12.6 12.6 it is ok friends 12.58 it has come 12.6 it is so volt i already written 12.6 and we will see what is the amp also so my amp no i have bought another new multimeter to check it so i kept it for 10 amps expecting we will see what is the amps you able to see friend it is 11 amps ok you able to see 11 amps so then we can see a small motor I have we will see how it runs also ok so we will see it now we will switch off this one now I will take a small motor we will see how it runs we are not supposed to connect no these are all very small motors but still we will do it This I am going to connect it. Okay. So you can see what is now. Just to see. Are you able to see the fire there? At the positive terminal, fires are there. Can you hear the noise? I will show you. Just nearing, I will show all this. Okay friends, you have seen the noise also. So this is, this battery we have made from the, right from the lead strip we have made, then we made a grid. So if you like this, kindly click the like button, comment, you can subscribe, I can still do better. This is the biggest battery I have made, you can in front of you, I have shown you what is the volt 12.6 and uh, ampere is found to be more than 10 amps 